At Two Point Hospital, over 52% of our patients believe they leave healthier than when they arrived. Hey guys, and welcome back to this episode 7 in Two Point Hospital Let's Play series. So we just were jumping into Mitten University Hospital last time. Uh, we got our research license and we got our training license. But we're now going to make our way around um, to getting our one star hospital. Uh, maybe even get to two stars. So the layout's a bit packed in. Um, I've got a huge queue on our psychiatri psychiatry um, psychiatric uh, uh, office because I haven't got a psychiatric doctor, which is a bit of a pain. Um, so I'm gonna have to train one of those up. So I'm gonna wait until this nurse has finished training. But anyway, let's jump straight into it. Um, the health minister's been going around, seems very happy. He's been giving the thumbs up to everything. Um, this is the first hospital where we've had um, the requirement for radiators. Um, also, people are complaining about being thirsty. So let's sort that out straight away. So we get a drinks machine in there, um, and a snacks machine, and even a salty snacks machine, just to make them very happy. Um, and always good to have a bin when you've got those as well. Um, so it seems like the whole place is quite clean, actually. We've got quite a clean place, so we'll leave that as is. Um, and we'll keep people happy with a drinking fountain. Um, and let's just get another bench in here. Um, so it'll fit. No, it won't fit. Okay. Well, instead of a bench, then what we'll do is we'll throw a leaflet stand in because they always like to have a nice leaflet stand. There we go. Lovely. So, everyone's gone straight to the machine, so it was obviously very popular. And straight to the leaflet stand. So, yes, people were bored, people were hungry, people were thirsty. Sorry. So, psychi psychiatry. So, let's get Dr. Hermann Freud. Very clever. Um, and then let's train up to two of you. Start training. There we go. Um, let's get a bit of good speed going on. So, promotion. You can have a little promotion, I suppose. Challenge. Cure seven patients with chest infection. Um, no, because I haven't actually got one. Um, challenge. Cure ten patients. Okay, I can do that. Uh, not now. No, I don't want to train you. Um, you can have a little bit of a boost. There you go. Um, and no, I won't train you because I've got some other people requiring pretty imminent training to get our hospital actually moving because at the moment uh, yeah we're making a thousand a month I suppose at least that's better than it was before when we were making nothing um, this research pod we've almost researched chromotherapy there we go research project complete well done we've completed a research project this discovery can be used across the whole organization Okay, that's good. So all your hospitals are able to use that research. So maybe I can go back to some of my one-star hospitals later on in the game and actually put that research in. Um, so you stop researching that. Oh no, let's put that back down. So what we'll do is we'll just edit this room because I really don't like the size of it. Um, and we'll put that in there. We'll move the windows over so that they're back on the wall. I'm a bit... I don't know why it doesn't do that. I think it's a bit of a... Oh, no, don't do that. Um, no, let's pick up you. Put you over there. Um, I feel like... Uh, no, let's put a few of them in there. Big bin um, and a couple plants. I had it all the way up to level four before, so I'm not sure exactly how I can get it back there, but, you know... So we get a clock on the wall, um, chair if they want to sit down somewhere else other than their desk. Guessing they need a radiator in there as well. Oh, psychiatry's already finished. That's good. That was very quick. So maybe we can fit in here. We can fit another researcher's desk, and that'll take us up, I think. Yeah, right over level four. There we go. We can research things a lot quicker now. Oh no. So it's not quite finished. Ah, oh, that was one person's learned psychiatry. Okay, that's good. So my cues are astronomical. So let's hire... Oh, I haven't got any money. Yes, this is a bit of an issue. Um, my reputation will be dropping dramatically. So now I've learned my chromotherapy. I need 21,000. 
Yeah, okay. Well, what we're going to do is we're going to turn the speed up. We're going to speed up a little bit. Um, and hopefully, looks like I'm making a little bit of money. We'll wait a few months and then we'll just carry on again. Okay, so that didn't work at all. Um, I've now ended up with much less money than I had in the first place. Um, so what we'll do is instead I'm going to take out a loan. Uh, nice big loan. Um, let's turn down the speed to normal speed. And we'll get some of these cure room, curing rooms over here. So I think I need a chromotherapy room to get to my next level. So we'll get one of them in. And those need to be a bit bigger. Um, and we'll get a door in, oh, it's a funny, funny looking place. Um, and a console in the corner. Let's not worry too much about the prestige, but let's just keep the hand sanitizer up. A um, couple plants just to keep it pleasant enough. The problem with the plants actually is that you then need a, you then need a handyman to come in and actually deal with the plants all the time. So we've got that in, maybe we need do we need a clown clinic as well, maybe? Because we had an emergency for clowns, but I couldn't take it because um, because I didn't have the room. So let's put that in there and take that one out there. That's nice. Um, and we'll chuck in the door and a couple windows in. All the way down there. Lovely. Um, it's already prestige level two, which is a good thing because it's such a big room, I suppose. Um, Extinguisher and a hand sanitizer. Oh, we're already at prestige level three. Lovely. Okay. So dehumorifier, as it's called, and what's this called? Colorizer. So there's a queue outside. Yeah, there's a massive queue, and I'm. I did try and reduce the size of this thing actually, um, but it it just seemed a bit impossible to be honest. Because so, I think it might be because people can't get past. So let's edit this and just take out, maybe let's just take out that bit and that bit and that bit. Is that going to improve the situation a bit? Um, they're just... Uh, no, I can't take that bit out. So I can do that. Yeah, sell my invalid items. There we go. So there's a bit more room to get around now. That might help. I might even be able to move this if I pick this up, can I move this over to here? Yeah, I can move this over as well, probably. Yeah, um, that's nice. So what I can do now is I can make this even smaller because that's going to help as well. Yeah, I do that, that's good. So that's a lot better now. People can get around a lot easier. All these people look on the edge of death. Um, which Meanwhile, isn't the news great, today, the so maybe I should, I don't think I'd need three GP's offices, but well, apparently I do, so let's flip it round. Um, okay. Well, I can fit that along there. Okay, let's have a nice big one then. Um... So there we go. Let's get all these on the wall. It is annoying that it doesn't like resize the room properly for you. You, you know, it's quite obvious what you want to do. If you're, if you're expanding the size of the room, everything that's on the wall, you'd want to keep on the wall in the same place, but apparently it doesn't seem, can't seem to work that out. Can't even seem to work out where to put a poster on the wall. So there we go. Um, okay. Alright. Lovely. Um, what was that? Is it the bin that's the issue? Or is it the... What is it that's the issue? Oh, is it the window, is it? Okay, there we go. Lovely. So I've got a huge GP's office now. Surely I have enough doctors for that. I've already got four doctors, four nurses, two assistants and three janitors. So there must be someone who can go and work in there. Um, I'm not really sure. People are running away. Okay, let's get some more benches over here. Um, 
I can't afford. Wow, I've already spent all of my 100,000 loan. That's, um, yeah, that's an issue. Well, I'm about to cure a patient, which will give me one star hospital, so hopefully I'll get a little money bonus from that. Um, lazy bones in the ward, yes, I can do that. There you go, being sprayed with red paint. Um, he's got Grey's Anatomy. Is it green paint now? Green paint. Oh, yeah, the colour's coming up. Oh, that is clever, isn't it? Doctors work in the controls. And then finally, blue paint. Get your full RGB. And there you are. Fully coloured now. And you can walk off. Happy as Larry. Well, that's always good. I like the little colourful bits on the front there. So everyone seems happy about that. So that's one patient. Oh, you're not cured. Hmm. Treatment failed. Does that mean you're dead? That's, um... Right. That's been... Embarrassing. Uh, deluxe clinic. So get patient to wait. Oh, I've got a bit of money now. Can I fit a deluxe clinic in anywhere? Can I fit one in down there at all? Just. Okay. Let's get a small deluxe clinic in. Um, big bin in. Let's just get it up to level 3. That will do the trick. Um, plant there. Um, couple posters. Go on, we're almost at level three as it is. There we go. Uh, let's get. I don't like leaving it just on the cusp of the level three for some reason. Okay, so we've got deluxe clinic. Um, I still need to cure one patient. So what's wrong with you? Unable to get where they want to be. You might need to rearrange things to unblock the route. Um, really? Is that because there's a health inspector standing in the middle there. Okay. Ah, that was a emergency. Ah, oh, you're just waiting to go in there to get changed to lie in the bed. It's a bit bizarre how you have an emergency but they just go and lie in a bed for a little while. And doesn't seem to be... doesn't seem to really be as much of an emergency as you'd think. Okay, here we go. Health inspector's visiting. Hopefully I get a bit more repu reputation because it's pretty poor at the moment. I've got a huge queue. Still eight people there, eight people there, seven people there. But I do have doctors in there working, so I'm not really sure why it's taking so long to train to treat them all. Um, maybe do I need to move... Should I get one of these benches? And I'll move them over here. Can I fit them in the corridor? I can't, can I? Okay, so I can fit one there, that'll be good. Um, everyone's about to die, this isn't going well. So I've killed one of my ward patients. Um, and uh, so once that's all done, so I cured two, failed one. Just, just not quite making enough money. I've still got another 10 months to pay back one of my um, loans and 19 months paying back my other one. So uh, once those are paid back, then I'll be able to take some more, more loans. But for now, I've just got to kind of hope for the best. So there's no doctor in there. So where's all my people at? So I've got staff. So how many staff have I got? So I've got... What are you? Are you a doctor? Does that mean doctor? Um, let's just look at doctors only. Okay. So I've got four doctors. Where are you all? Two of you are good in psychiatry. Where are you? Oh, you're in the toilet. Okay. You're in the GP's office. So I don't really have enough doctors, but I just can't really afford many. Let's just get... Okay. All right. Let's just... I can't afford you either. Yearly review awards. Two point county healthcare award ceremony. So what are my awards? Very exciting. Open all. Oh, okay. Only rising star and employee of the year. I normally get about six of them. So I'm not doing very well on this hospital. This one's really challenging me. Maybe I've screwed up with this reception area in the middle there. Um, another dead person. I'm just killing people left, right and centre. Um, it's really not good. My queues are still 8 and 8. Um, only 5 over here. Maybe that doctor's a lot better at getting it all done. Um, and I still haven't had a doctor 
cure someone in chromotherapy. I had an opportunity and then, yeah, for some reason, he went and died. So, where's this guy? Who's he? Albert Pong. Let's, um, let's push him up the queue a bit more. Um, and who's he? That's Logan. Let's push him up the queue as well. Let's get some chromotherapy patients through the queue. Um, more dead people. Excellent. So cured two out of four. So I got a bit of money at least. Um, and I got some reputation and stuff. Uh, promotes three staff. Okay, I'll accept the challenge. I uh, probably won't promote them for a while. Uh, current qualification. Promotion from junior nurse to nurse will provide one training slot, 10% movement speed, 10% diagnosis skill, and 10% treatment skill. So there are 12 other members of staff. So maybe I should just do... I should probably be doing a bit more training, you know. That's probably one of my issues. So maybe what I need to do is I need to give you stamina, motivation. Does motivation... Okay, that increases speed. Um, that... Oh, you can tra train them in that. That's good. Um, maybe I need one of the doctors. So one of my doctors, what have you got? You've got research. I don't care as much. Maybe I do that one. Um, and I've got lots of spaces, so... Maybe we get another student nurse in there. Um, so there's a hell of a lot of my staff in the training room. Let's see how they do. Okay. So I'm at, oh, I made some money there. I made 35,000 last month. So let's see. My loans. I can repay that one at least. Because um, you do pay quite a lot of interest. So it's best to repay them as quickly as you possibly can. Um, can I fit... I want another There's drinks machine, like really. And I wonder whether my layout of my hospital with my benches in the middle of the in the middle of the way don't really help my efficiency. Let's get that on there. And then let's get an item, let's get a drinks machine in, because everyone get out of my way. There we go, lovely. Okay, another drinks machine. That should sort you out. Um, nurse to clown clinic okay what else have I got so promote three staff I've still got 180 days to do that so I've trained I'm training three people in there so that should be a good opportunity to promote them so we'll send them to psychiatry for treatment okay have I got anyone in psychiatry I now have two doctors who are able to do psychiatry oh god this is they've given us some money for training someone oh that's good I didn't know they did that so that's one person in, in motivation, should speed them up. Um, how much more? So another 12 to 15 days. So staff promotion, let's promote you, make you a bit happier. Promote you, there we go. So I've done one, two more to go. These guys are learning, they're getting motivated, they're all happy, almost there. 80%, 86%, 90%, come on. There you go. Tiffany Leopard, intern janitor, you're the one. Get your get your motivation going. Oh, wow. Okay, I'll train you in a minute. Let's promote you. Give you a bit more money. Why not? Um, I'll give you a bit more money. There you go. And I've sorted out my staff request. Lovely. Um, so I want to train you, but it says that the room's not available because that guy's still learning. There you go. Train now. What do you want to learn? You want to learn research. I don't know. Uh, you just want to learn anything. Oh, okay. Well, that's fine. So you've got research already. Um, maybe I... What do I do with you? Maybe I make you a good diagnostic person. I'll get a guest trainer in for that. Um, and I'll get, I don't know, maybe a couple more people training. So it's good actually, so what I realise now is I need to send more people for training because that's going to earn me good money. So I got that, so that's 25% happiness and kudos, 10%. Um, so I can't train you right now because I've got people in there. Oh, and my money just plummeted, so I'm not sure why, because I seem to be making 6000 each month. Illness Mockstar, okay, that's that Freddie Mercury looking guy, not now, not now. So I should be having some people learn. So you're going in there. Are you the trainer? Yeah, you're going to tra train them in. What are you going to train them in? 
what are you teaching? Diagnostics. So Crystal Bane. So a couple couple doctors learning some diagnostics. That's always a good thing. Way One Star Hospital. Dear Hospital Administrator, congratulations. Your hospital has been awarded a one star rating by the Two Point Health Ministry. Bodes well that your organization has begun to dabble in research. Our initial notes suggested, wrongly it seems, that you weren't well suited to this particular task. Rest assured, wrong that, that whoever was responsible for such an off-the-mark remark will be losing their job forthwith. Unless it was me, of course. Perish the thought. Continue with your studies for more awards or go elsewhere and expand your organisation. So I've unlocked the Encyclopedia Book Place and the Deluxe Alux Level 3. Oh, okay. So my Deluxe Alux, are you going... Okay, there's no one in there, so what we'll do is we'll wait until this guy's treatment is done. So there you go. New head. Lovely! Trained up. Lovely. So let's upgrade to Deluxe Alux 2. You know what? I need some benches over here. Everyone's just kind of standing outside there, aren't they? Um... So we'll keep going. Oh, no, not there. Not there. Sorry, mate. That's not against the wall. It's a bit silly it let me do that. Um, so there we go. Couple benches. Um, lovely. I've trained some more people. Um, maybe I can even fit in a salty snacks machine there, can I? No, it just clashes with the door. That's a shame. We'll fit one in there then instead. Nice big bin in the corner. And then a nice drinks machine in the corner as well. Lovely. So, to get to Two Star Hospital, we've got to train 10 more staff, generate 2,000 more research points. Let's do some research. Um, let's do some training research. Investigate new research methods to help us train even better researchers. No, let's not do that. Uh, let's do X-ray. Um, let's start that one. Um, do you do it? Do you do one per desk? Or you just do research and then the researchers will come in by the looks of it. Lovely. Um, and I need to cure 50 patients. That's going to be the hard part. So I haven't got anyone in pharmacy management. So we probably should get a couple people learning that. Um, let's get all three of you doing that. Um, in the meantime, I'm probably going to need some more nurses just to kind of tide us over. And that's probably going to help us not kill everyone because it's not great. Um, and it probably takes a while to... Yeah, okay, here we go. We're going to get some good movement now because we've got some people trained in diagnostics. Oh, janitor, suck up the ghost. Everyone's running away. There's two ghosts. Get that ghost as well. Everyone's terrified. Oh, that's not ideal. Okay, more training. Yeah, promote you because you learned something new. Um, okay, need to get the thermal comfort up. Thermal comfort should already be quite high, but... Oh yeah, it's 70%. Okay. So what I'll do is I'll get some more... Oh, I can filter up here, can I? So I can type in radiator? No? Okay. I can do it in a grid. I don't know if I like that. Well, I suppose it's a bit better. Um, it's a bit cold in there, isn't it? Okay. There we go. Do I need a radiator in that room as well? Does every room need a radiator? That's a shame. Okay. Um, oh, they must be freezing doing their training. Um, oh, well, I've already got my thermal comfort up high, so there we go. That'll do. It's quite sufficient. Why are all these people so unhappy? What's wrong with you? Unhappy. We'll leave soon. So you've been <laughs> almost a year. 290 days. Oh, no. Yes, this is... um. Yes. I'm not doing that well, am I? That's... Uh... Bad, bad work. So they gave me 5000 for training someone at least. Um, so I'm not losing as much money as I was before. So I got some happiness from my challenge. I can't train you right now. Um, seven patients with mock star. Okay. It's probably a bad idea because I already have nine people in the queue for the psychi psychiatric clinic. Um... Yeah, and I've only got one or two psychiatrists, and I think they're both in training right now. Uh, no, those are nurses. Okay, where are my psychiatrists then? Um, probably in GP's offices or something. What are you just sitting around for? Ah, I need some benches, that's what I need, so... Okay. Uh, 
Okay, a couple more benches. Um, so what we'll do is we'll just get a few more benches in there. That's good. We're not going to get up to our level uh, you know, two-star hospital today. Um, that's going to take a while. I've got an astronomical number of patients waiting. Um, uh, they can't get through really, can they? That's the issue. So we'll get that out of the way. They can't get through. No one can get through the corridors. Uh, I see. So who's in the queue? Look. Move you right up to the front of the queue. Why are you at the back of the queue? I have no idea. Uh, move you right up to the front of the queue as well. Um, move you right up to the front of the queue as well. Um, okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. I'm not going to make this research this uh this uh emergency work. I don't think because. I've got 14 people in my queue at present. Um, and you are going to the back of the queue. Yeah, you're all wandering off, all loving life. You're having a great time in there. Yeah, okay. That's not ideal. So I'm making money at least. Let's get my loan. Can I repay it? No, I can't repay it yet. But maybe I take out that loan and repay that one there we go so I've got a bit more a bit more money now um, I've not got to earn a, that much more to repay that loan so maybe I'd promote you a little bit promote and I'll get some training going and we'll probably leave it there for now so injection administration bedside manner treatment maybe I get my treatment up because I feel like I haven't got good treatment going at the moment um, and then who else are we going to take in there? So we'll take you in there, we'll take you in there, a couple of doctors, maybe we'll take another another nurse in. Um, so we'll do that, start training, it's all looking good. And what we'll do is we'll leave it there for today. The hospital is a mess, I may need to clean some things up but maybe we'll just pick up straight from here. 10 people waiting, 9 people waiting. Eight people waiting. Fifteen people waiting for the waiting for the psychiatry, um, the psychiatric uh, ward. So, what we'll do is we'll leave it there for today. Thank you very much for watching, and I shall see you next time.